Hey everyone, come back for more EXO Heroes content. So what we have here right now is a face-off between Brun and Vagabond Nation. So as you have, uh, um, as you have seen, these two nations um, were the last two nations that dropped. Um, I think probably one or two months apart, being uh, Vagabond being the most recent one, a couple of days ago. So let's 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 pit them against each other and see who comes out on top. So for Brun Nation, so their advantage is they have a lot of damage over time um, attacks, uh, especially with Dorka and with uh, Kylock. So the two of them bring a lot of damage over time um, to the team. And um, they also, um, Dorka as well brings mana to the team. So for front and, and back row allies. Healing and defense as well because of uh, Naomi. So the for me, the synergy of the nation is more on defense. And while you're defending the team, throw a lot of damage over time um, skills or effects so that you could, you know, um, trigger them slowly and continuously to add to that whole damage. But their big disadvantage as a team or as a nation is they have low damage output. Um, I think only two has damage over time, only Dorka and only Kyla. So for Naomi, it, she has more of share health and uh, immune to damage. So for them to bring out more damage, they need help. Um, they also need additional defense because they have to shell themselves in order, in order to deal a lot of damage over time damage. So my recommendation for if you want to bring Brun Nation as a team, three of them, so namely Dorka, Naomi, and Kylak, you bring FC Jinai because FCG9 brings, um, I think, additional damage for damage over time, skills and effects. Um, she is actually crucial to the team. Um, she gives a lot of um, damage in terms of her AOE, and uh, she brings overall utility as well. To bring up additional defense, uh, this team would need FC Garf. Because FC Garf doesn't need to compete with Naomi's Provoke. So FC Garf will bring shared health to the lowest um, HP member of the group. And also F uh, take note that FC Garf has damage over time as well uh, for one of his skills. So that is why FC Garf is a good complement to this team. Again, it would really depend on what what heroes you have in your roster again this is just a recommendation guys uh, i'm not saying that you should use this together with the whole brand nation team so again my other recommendation if you don't have fc garf you could use crystal because to be honest with you crystal is a hidden gem i've been i've been trying to to work with her kit right now i still have to play test her i'm still on the development stage somehow and on how to make her kit very good i'm still wait waiting for her to be unleashed or her potential to be unleashed so grizzle you bring her for her shared health similar to garf and grizzle actually has a skill that can blind an enemy hero so what blind does is i think for a couple of turns they cannot the, the attack doesn't hit it autom automatically misses that is why I like Grizzle. I like to develop her 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 kit. So more or less, um, it depends, guys, on what heroes do you have. Um, feel free to play around if you want to. Um, if you want to use this synergy uh, for the Brun Nation. So for Vagabond, um, their advantage clearly with Schmid coming into the picture is their attack reset as one of the skills of Schmidt. So they have high damage because of, of Zeon, of course. 
Um, and um, turn re the attack reset is actually, or turn reset is actually very important because um, because it you know gives you times two uh, or times two attack with a similar skill if you have enough mana. So and also they have HP regen for Sewa and healing as well, which is actually very good. Um, anyway, this team I think was built really to be around Schmidt. Um, they are not as good individually, meaning uh, Awakened Zion and Seo, they're not as good without Schmidt. So that is why I, I want um, also you guys to know how to build a team around them. So their disadvantage is that they need other high damage heroes because for this team, you need to deal as much damage as possible and for for the enemy to give a counter attack they would they're already crippled they they can no longer deal as much damage so deal as much damage as possible within the first two thirds that's the that's the the theme for the for, for Vag vagabond nation also the key for them is their additional mana source they need that badly because uh, although Schmidt gives uh, additional mana for the back row, but they will need eventually either um, uh, Iris or Dorka. Dorka has to come from the other team and help them. So Iris for her plus two mana every turn, Dorka for her mana uh, addition and, and, and for additional heal. But FCG9 is also crucial to this one. If FCG9 gave... Um, gave uh, what you call this gave brun nation um additional uh, additional damage for over for for the damage over time effects or or she 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 enhances damage over time effects what she will give to this this team is a speed advantage in terms of attack speed so although she will also give it to the other to the other team but it's more important to them because the, the key to their victory is is attack 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 so relentless attack coming from all of the heroes deliver high damage deliver fast damage on our last uh, topic for this video which team will you pick which team do you think would uh, win over the other will it be the Brun team which thrives on defense and on and on damage over time or will it be vagabond which thrives on quick relentless attacks and high damage so again guys um, if you want to bring uh if you want to try their 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 synergies whether brun or vagabond um the ones that i suggested in terms of recommended um heroes is actually the the i think the most um, the utmost uh, recommendation that I have but again if you don't have those heroes you can mix and match with whatever you have in your roster okay so for any comments suggestions in terms of teams that you picked whether your team Brun or your team Vagabond please put it in the comments below anyway guys this is the warden I'm out